Okay. Hey guys, Zero Eleven here, and today we're gonna be opening up the Alexi Lafreniere collection, and we'll get into what you can get in this. But first, we're opening up some mail for this video. So after we open up some mail, we'll check this box out. But let's get into some mail. All right, we got some older mail here. Been meaning to open this one for quite a while. I think it's from January or February. Hey Ziri, my name is Mateo. Love the vids. Watch them daily. Already a subscriber on two devices, and I post a like on every video I watch of yours. Appreciate that. Thank you for the support. I hope you like the mail I sent you today. Including the mail are some of my cards that I randomly found on my PC. There's nothing big, just some recent pulls and just some base that I found. I recently opened a 1920 SBA box and pulled a Ryan Lindgren FWA, which I did not include in the mail, and a Kirby Doc Future Watch Out Redemption. Interesting timing on that, for me at least, uh, which I am trying to redeem, but such a freaking pain in the butt. Mine is in the system, but I tried putting other cards in the system and it didn't work like that. MVP Redemption, they didn't even show up, so I don't know what I'm gonna do, but also recently opened a Upper Deck Series 1 retail box, one of those tiny 8 card per pack, 7 packs per box one, so a blaster, which was a gift from a close friend. I pulled a Matthew Kachuk Dazzler's Green, included in the mail and two or three young guns not included i sent a package for james so make sure you give him that i pc Connor mcdavid and max domi so if you get any of those guys i'd be delighted to have them sent my way i have three slits of paper inside that i would like you to sign please well that's enough talking from me i want you to open the mail so i'll leave it to you keep up the great content best of luck from mateo all right mateo i mean i do not see slits of paper the name on the package did not match the name on the note so i don't know what address to ship it to so you're gonna have to get in contact with me regardless let's see what mateo sent here let's start with this probably go through this one fairly quick because it seems like there's gonna be quite a few base cards here but <laughs> frick right off brad there yeah some base here that's a nice mcdavid base there but looks like we got some uh, series one base this package was from quite a while ago but there you go we got one for james here yeah right here james Ooh, yikes uh that's a big yikes um <laughs> Uh, jeez. That's one thing. Don't ever. Well, these are better, but don't ever do that. It'll frick up the card. I know that from experience. So, especially with like elastic bands, those completely mess up cards. So, okay. So we got we got some leaves here. So there you go. There's some leaves from 1920 SBA. Okay. What do we got in this one? More leaves. Okay. There's how many Oilers now? Janssen. This is the box set ones. The blue ones there. Nylander there. Tavares. Matthews. Matthews. Muzzin. Muzzin. Capitan, Capitan. Also, there's this in here. Second year OV McDonald's card. That's pretty cool there. Second year OV. So, I'm not sure if that was a part of the package, but it was in the package. So, there's that. Yeah, with some of the older packages, there could be some mix-ups. I apologize for that in advance, but... Ooh, we got one of these. I think I have the Western version of these, but... <laughs> frick right off there. These are cool. There's Sid. Paul Mary. Oh, look at that. Western Stars McDavid. That's really cool there. McKinnon. Nice. Look at these. Kane. There you go. And Burn Shifley. That's cool right there. I haven't seen those before. Nice. Okay, next one up here. What the heck is this? Oh, Mitchell Stevens Young Guns. That's not too bad there. Then we got Yol Kiviranta Young Guns. Also solid. Patrick Kane. NHL Worldwide. I think I'm going to start full on PC and Kane. I'd love to get a cup of RPA of his, but they ain't cheap. Last one with a nice patch. Yeah, I'll throw it up on screen there. I went for a lot. That's like a card I really want, though. But always looking for more future watches of him. I just think his stuff is underappreciated. He's one of my favorite players of all time as well, but Cole Sherwood, MVP rookie. Ooh, Joe Thorne, SBX. Uh, like third year Jumbo Joe. Florida Panther Jumbo Joe. So best of luck to him in Florida. Messier Essentials and wow. Oh my gosh. Did not see that coming. Jeremy Lauzon, Seattle Kraken, clear cut young guns. That's actually awesome right there. That is really sick. Uh I thought this package was gonna have a bunch of base. But this is really awesome there. Lauzon, clear cut. He's really solid top 4D right there. One of the picks that hit back in 2015 there. So wow, I did not see that one coming. Alright, well, let's continue on here. Let's see, then we got some base here. Nephew Tyler, nice. There's nephew Tyler. Goudreau, Lil Jagrin rookie there, uh, Panera, let's see how they say it there, Lil Yagrin, yeah, I've heard him say Lil Jagrin, but I guess it's Lil Yagrin, all right, McDavid, always take more McDavid, Carey Price, Sid, always take more Sid, there you go, Carter Hart, nice, okay, next up here, oh, there it is, the Matthew Kachuk Green Dazzlers, pretty much kept all my Dazzlers, that's nice there, Bernier canvas, still have a crap ton of canvases, kept all my, uh, 2021 canvases, so, there's that, Jari, we got some base there. All star update base. Terravine red. Point red. Next up here, pack opening experience here. We got some base here from SBA. Yep. SBA. There we go. Yeah, after opening my next box of 1920 SBA, I think I'm done for good. And then again, I don't want to say never, but oh, that OV's a little messed up there. It's unfortunate. Uh, there's Phil. <laughs> Not going to say his name. Oh, jeez. So there you go. Contenders Broder and Marlowe. Huh. Okay, more SBA base. See if there's any decent names in here. Seen these way too many times. There's Crosby, nice. Okay. Yeah, I put all the big stars aside into one big pile. I should do a collection video on here. It's kind of warranted right now. I mean, I did one on Patreon, but I gotta do one on here. Kind of getting out of hand and I need to talk about it, but yeah. 
So there we go. So Mateo, thank you for that unexpected, really awesome package. So really appreciate it. Get in contact with me. I'm not sure where I need to send those autographs. So get in contact with me, please. All right, next package is a <laughs> Small one here. It's from Williams Top Box Card Breaks once again. It's a small one here. Before I open that, there's a little note here. Hi, Ziri. <laughs> I know, okay. I keep up the great work from Williams Top Card Break. We are you huge <laughs> Leafs fan. I'm sorry. Merry Christmas. It's uh, mid-August right now. I apologize for that. I really need to get caught up. But that's the thing. I have quite the lineup of boxes coming up here, but maybe I should deliberately not open some of these and then get caught up with mail and save some of those nicer boxes for when it's closer to the season, but... Oh, one of these again. One of these business cards are cool there. <laughs> there's William. But that's nice there. Uncle Todd, that's 203, 304, 304 ice. Nice. Wanted to get a box of that hunting flurry and Bergeron, but missed my chance. Like a lot of older rare boxes. But thank you guys for that once again. And Merry Christmas. <laughs> All right, next package up here. This might be the last one that will open up the Lafreniere collection. But hey, Ziri, I've been watching your videos for quite some time now, and it's quite nice to see and hear about the knowledge you have about the hobby. I started collecting during the 2005 6 season. That's a good year to collect. I mean, I was collecting freaking Pokemon back then, which, I mean, Gold Star. Or Sinovi cards. I uh, can't really go wrong, I would say. Yes, I lucked out and got the two big young guns. Only stop around 2010. I stopped around 2011 and got back in, in 2015. For the record, I started back up again in the 2016 17 season, good year, and I've been collecting ever since. Please keep these videos coming. Will do. They're so fun to watch. I really appreciate that. Good luck with future breaks. Cheers from Vancouver, BC. Justin. And then it's cut off there, I guess. But Justin, let's see what you sent. Looks like we just got a small little package here. Hey, we got a future watch from 0607. Not my favorite design for future watch. Watches, the non auto but regardless, don't think I have Josh Hennessy there, so I'll put that one in the Future Watch collection there. Oh, Uncle Todd, I don't think I have that one. Hold on, what the heck's going on here? Oh, but there you go. Uncle Todd, is that a rookie? Uncle Todd, it's pretty close if it is. Oh, it shows Guelph Storm, so it might be right there. $95 there, so I don't think I have that Uncle Todd rookie. I might, I have to check though, but always love getting Fisherman Uncle Todd and Rob McViker, Future Watch with yellow pads on the Canucks there. The 1999, do not have that one. What the heck happened to the Future Watch itself there? Like the writing, oh, out of whack. Regardless, I'll put Put that in the collection there. Eventually, I want to get the set for 0506. Still need Henrik Lundqvist. That's like the key one. Cam Barker Redemption is another one. But yeah. So, Justin, thank you for that package there. Really do appreciate it. Okay, with that out of the way, let's get into this Lafreniere collection box. So, we're getting 26 cards per box. Select boxes will include a rare autograph card, and they are extremely rare. So, out of those 26 cards, 25 will be highlights cards, and one of them will be a moment slash awards card. And those autographs, it looks like there's only 25 total. Like the box set there, they were 1 in 20 boxes. There's 25 total autographs autographs here they are hand numbered apparently and they're the moments autograph from what i see that's the ones that you can get so yeah you're pretty much not getting an auto in here but let's check out the laugh box okay let's see if i can slide it out here yeah okay there's the 26 cards so how the heck do we open this here without being an idiot okay here we go so this card number one okay it's card number one so i guess that's nhl debut january 14th so there's a little thing on him there so i guess his inscribed future watch will be january 14th there's a draft picture right there there's him with that reverse retro nice jersey there. First NHL goal in Buffalo, I'm assuming. Yep, that was a nice goal. There you go. Uh laugh again okay there's him with team canada there interesting there's him against philly what's the correlation there fifth career assist okay there's him with sid that's actually nice i don't know if any of these cards have any value but him with sid that's cool does it say that yeah there you go Sidney crosby so i know cards with two noteworthy players have some value it's kind of funny that a uh, variation has like taylor hall in the background another former first overall pick but there's lafreniere again against buffalo there's him on ramuski there you go more ramuski laugh cards bunch of ramuski cards there i feel like i've seen that picture before but there you go there's him scoring a goal against buffalo <laughs> that's pretty common there but there you go uh there's him regame there and there's sorokin in the back there he got three shots there his rookie year started slow he had like two goals and like 19 or 20 games and he picked it up towards the end but yeah it's definitely not a bust definitely not. hey there's him and panarin that's cool there there's him and Keandre Miller. So there's that. Yeah, a lot of these are kind of just basic there. So there you go. Oh, there you go. Here's that moments card or whatever the heck it is. That's kind of cool. That's like the gold foil there. That's him during the draft. Kind of a not so great picture there, but that was the feed they had, I guess. There you go, Lafreniere. After winning his second consecutive CHL Player of the Year award in 1920, Lafreniere became the first oceanic skater to be selected first overall since 05, when Pittsburgh made Cindy Crosby the number one pick after he won his second straight CHL Player of the Year award. So there you go. So there's a laugh collection box. Don't expect an auto from this. Interesting little thing. If Lafreniere pans out, it'll be a nice little set to have. I don't think he's going to be best player in the league, but he's going to be a really good player. So there's laugh. Yeah, guys, there's another mail. There's a Lafreniere collection box. Stay tuned for more breaks to come. And as always, thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys later.